Hey everyone, this is Mike coming back to you and we are just going along and creating our course in the Golf Club 2019. Our next step is that we have to go ahead and open up TGC 2019. We have to create a blank course file. So we're going to create that file here. Getting into the game, it needs the blank course file because it needs to import everything into something. And that's what it imports it into. It's rather easy. Okay, so I'm doing this in the Steam version. Many of you would be doing it in the simulator version, but it works pretty much just the same. Okay. So I'm going to go over and I'm going to go to my designer up here and I'm going to go to new course. All right. So we're creating a new course here. Uh, we're going to go ahead and choose a theme. And our theme is going to be, we're going to start out, I think it's going to end up being countryside, but I'm uh, countryside or rustic, but I'm not sure which one I'm going to use yet. I'm going to, I'm going to go ahead and look at it and I can always change this later. So I got my theme. I'm going to go ahead and, and zero everything out. I'm just going to work my way through all these tabs and get zero on everything. So once I hit my apply, I can just go ahead and hit escape and that will take me back. So I've got my theme, I've got my train all zeroed out, my layout. I want this on zero holes. Most years will say 18. I went into the presets and I set it at, at zero so because this is how I always use it. I just want everything set to zero. I don't want anything extra when I'm creating a LiDAR course. I just want this to be totally blank, no hills, no water, no nothing. So I hit apply and escape it. And then our course that we're looking at is Quail Meadows. Okay, Quail Meadows right there. I've got my theme, I've got my terrain, I've got my layout, and then what I do is I need to hit continue. Okay, so I'll go ahead and do that. It's now saving the course, so I'll say this course is now saved, but others will not see it until it's published. So it's saved in my system, but it's not out on TGC right now. I don't want it there, I just want it to be a blank course file. Okay, so right now I have created this part this is a nice and easy part to do, but I want to make sure that um, everyone is on the same page with how to go about doing it. Um, and this is all you need to do in this step. Just takes you a couple minutes. Uh, in our next video, we will go ahead and learn how to take and put everything into a file and get it ready for Chad's tool. So that's all we have for you today. I hope that you have a good day, and I will see you all later.